I want to bring good news to you this evening. But before I do that, I would like to read from the book of Luke, chapter 2, verses 10 downwards, which our happy is going to read. Luke chapter 2, verse 10. But the angel reassured them, don't be afraid. He said, I bring you good news that will bring great joy to all the people. The Savior, yes, the Messiah, the Lord, has been born today in Bethlehem, the city of David. And you will recognize him by the sign. You will find a baby wrapped snugly in strips of cloth, lying in a manger. Suddenly, the angel was joined by a vast host of others, the armies of heaven praising God and saying, Glory to God in highest heaven, and peace on earth to those with whom God is pleased. When the angel had returned to heaven, the shepherds said to each other, Let's go to Bethlehem. Let's see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has told us about. They hurried to the village and found Mary and Joseph, and there was the baby lying in the manger. After seeing him, the shepherds told everyone what had happened and what the angel had said to them about this child. The good news is the Lord Jesus was born in Bethlehem. That good news is being spread throughout the world on this Christmas day. But who is this Christ? Do you know him personally? I do know him personally. He was born in Bethlehem, and because he was born in Bethlehem, the city of David, it is universally celebrated throughout the world. But one thing you must understand, Christmas is being celebrated without Christ. That is not Christmas. Today, we are so happy that we can celebrate Christmas with Christ. He is always with you. I remember the day when I was in Jerusalem many, many years ago. We walked to the city of Jerusalem. I couldn't help by him because that was where the Lord Jesus was born. And he is always with us. He will never forsake us, nor will he give us comfort us. So the good news to you today is believe in the Lord Jesus Christ, and you and your family can be here. That's all I want to say. Thank you very much for being here this time. God bless you.